Hello and welcome to channel Unlocks Hub. Today in this video I will be showing you how to remove iCloud lock or activation lock on a MacBook Pro M2. So this is a MacBook Pro M2 variant. You can see it has two USB-C slots and it has headphones jack here 3.5 mm. And this MacBook Pro M2 is currently iCloud activation lock and you can see the same. So it is asking for an Apple ID and password which was previously used and we don't have that and I'll be showing you how to remove the iCloud lock or activation lock on a MacBook Pro M2 using the unlock sub USB configurator files. Click on subscribe button and press the bell icon if you haven't done that already. If you have any doubts or questions you can ask in the comment section. If you need the files, just email us on our email address given in the video description. We are not available on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, WhatsApp or any other social media applications. We are available on this YouTube channel and the email address given below in the video description only. So copy the email address given below and email us right away if you need the USB configurator files. Let me just plug this in first. So before that let me show you that this MacBook Pro M2 is iCloud activation locked. Let me restart it and see what it shows. So I have turned it off forcefully. Let me turn it on. And it comes up to the activation lock page. It says this Mac is linked to Apple ID. Enter the Apple ID and password that was previously used. I'll be showing you how to remove the iCloud lock or activation lock using the unlock sub USB configurator files. Let me just plug it in. And now I'll enter the DFU mode or the recovery mode, whatever you can call it. So first I'll force turn off the MacBook Pro M2. Now once the MacBook is completely turned off and the unlock sub USB configurator is plugged in, press and hold the power button, keep holding it until it enters the recovery mode. It says loading startup options, just wait for it to turn on. And this has entered into the recovery mode. Click on options and click continue. And you are in macOS recovery. Click on the disk utility option, click continue. And click on the Macintosh HD option and erase it first. So click on done once it is completed. Now just restart the MacBook once again or just shut it down and we will enter the recovery mode using the power button. So once again the MacBook is completely turned off and now I will be pressing and holding the power button to enter the recovery mode. It says continue holding for startup options and it says loading startup options. So once you are in this page, click on the install macOS monitoring option, click continue. Let me continue with the setup process quickly. So 
select the internal hard drive and click continue. Let me just connect it to the power source and yes, the installation has started. Just wait for it to complete. Do not unplug the unlock sub USB configurator files at any point of time. Let me just uh, check the power source. The power source is turned off. And yes, now I have connected it to the power source. Make sure the MacBook is connected to the power source and it is turned on and it is in the charging state. And the installation has started. Wait for it to complete. It says about 59 minutes remaining. This whole process takes somewhere about one hour. Make sure to wait and do not unplug the unlock sub USB configurator files at any point of time. If you need the unlock sub configurator files, you know what to do. Just email us on our email address given below. If you have any doubts or questions, you can ask in the comment section. Don't forget to click on subscribe button and press the bell icon to get notified as soon as we post a new video. Wait for the MacBook to turn on completely. Let me set it up quickly and find out if the iCloud lock is present or not. I'll be adding an Apple ID later, you have to do the same too. Click on set up later and skip.
and the MacBook has finally turned on and it is now completely iCloud free. Let me go to settings. It says sign in with your own Apple ID and password. You can click on sign in and log in with your own Apple ID and password. You can now plug out the unlock sub USB configurator files and use the MacBook without any issues. If you need the files, you know what to do. Just email us on our email address given in the video description. If you have any doubts or questions, you can ask in the comment section. Click on subscribe button if you haven't done that already. This MacBook Pro M2 is now completely iCloud free. This is the same MacBook Pro M2 with which I started this video. And you can unplug the power cable as well and use your MacBook Pro without any problem. Thank you for watching guys. Have a great day. Take care. Bye-bye.